Kate Upton is an American model and actress. She is widely recognized for gracing the covers of famous magazines, including Vanity Fair's 100th anniversary issue, Sports Illustrated Swimsuit, Cosmopolitan, British Vogue, French Elle, Esquire, and Jalouse. She has featured in fashion editorials for Harper's Bazaar, B Magazine, and Vogue Spain. She is also an actress, having played important roles in movies like Tower Heist and The Other Woman. Apart from appearing in the popular late-night comedy show Saturday Night Live, she has also appeared in a number of talk shows, including Jimmy Kimmel Live, The Late Show, Late Night with Jimmy Fallon, and The Ellen DeGeneres Show amongst others. Kate has also worked with some of the most renowned photographers in the fashion world. As a model, she has appeared in several commercials for brands like Sobe, Carl's Jr., and Mercedes-Benz. She has also worked with Gillette and Skull Candy. While working with Beach Bunny Swimwear, she designed a collection for the brand. A keen dancer, Kate made heads turn when her dance video went viral on YouTube, she danced to the song Teach Me How to Dougie by Cali Swag District. Kate Upton was born Catherine Elizabeth Upton on June 10, 1992, in Street Joseph, Michigan, USA, to Shelley and Jeff Upton. She shifted to Florida when she was seven years old and studied at the Holy Trinity Episcopal Academy. Her mother Shelley Upton is a former Texas state tennis champion, while her father worked as a high school athletics director. Her uncle Fred Upton is a United States representative. Kate started modeling at the age of 15 after being signed to Elite Model Management in 2008. She then moved to New York City and signed with IMG Models. She ranked third in Ask Men Web Portal's Top 99 Most Desirable Famous Women in 2012. The same year, she was named the fifth sexiest model by Models. Come. Her bold photo shoots for Sports Illustrated enabled her to feature on Maxim Magazine's Hot 100 list. Kate describes herself as a religious person. During a photo shoot, she was mocked for wearing a cross necklace. The incident shook her and she felt objectified. She later got herself a tattoo of a cross on her finger. She has often spoken against being objectified and the importance of treating models with respect. After appearing on the cover of Sports Illustrated for the first time, she took a lot of time to recover from the feedback and the nasty comments that she received.